Hi there. People often ask me, what is Joomla? Uh, as you may know from the previous episodes of, of our series, there are uh, several ways of creating a website. Based on the tools that you use to create a website, uh, you can divide the, the ways into three big categories. Uh, you can build a website from an HTML template, the static template. You can build it from a CMS template, and you can build it with a website builder software, uh, which is hosted online. Uh, this CMS section is where uh, Joomla is, uh, is hiding. Uh, Joomla is, uh, is a software that, that is used to build websites. That's a content management system. Uh, it is pretty old and it's pretty popular, or well, at least it used to be, uh, but more on that later. Um, there are several things that make Joomla special. Uh, the first thing is that it's open source. Uh, this means that it is free to use. You may download it and you may uh, use it for, for your website and you will not have to pay for it. Uh, and uh, what's also very important about it is that its source code uh, is available for modifications. Uh, this actually leads us to the, uh, to the next uh, special thing about Joomla, uh, which is its architecture. Uh, there is something that you can call a core functionality of Joomla, uh, and there are things that are built on top of that core functionality, which would be the, the design theme and the extensions. With the design theme, it's pretty obvious. Uh, the design theme is uh, something that defines how your website will, will look. Uh, and uh, sometimes how it will work. The extensions are the bits of, uh, of functionality uh, that your website needs and that are not included into the core functionality. Um, actually, these things, uh, the themes and extensions, are built by the Joomla community. Uh, the, the community is... Uh, is pretty vast, actually. That's because of the uh, the open source status. A lot of people build the extensions for Joomla. A lot of build, people build uh, themes and design templates for it. Uh, and uh, what's the most important thing about the community is that uh, the community communicates uh, the problems of Joomla and uh, provides assistance to people working with, with this CMS. Uh, so that the uh, uh, the web professionals wouldn't feel left alone uh, with this whole thing. Um, speaking of the uh, the the uh, left alone thing, uh, as cool as this whole thing may sound, uh, I have to admit that Joomla's popularity is falling pretty fast currently. Um, the uh, the competition on the market is getting pretty rough uh, and. Uh, uh, because of the stability and uh, security issues, Joomla has lost a lot of its popularity over the past five years. It has been on its peak around uh, six or five years ago in 2009 and 2010. Uh, and uh, today's solutions like WordPress, for example, are a lot more advanced. I do have to admit that. However, uh, what also has to be admitted is that Joomla remains a very popular software uh, in many parts of the world. Uh, it is still used by hundreds of thousands of, of professionals all over the world. And uh, it can be used by beginners and, uh, and by seasoned professionals. So it's just something that, uh, that you have to get used to. And uh, uh, the, the bugs and the... Uh, and the other things about Joomla that, that some people don't like can be fixed. There are extensions that may, uh, they may fix that. So uh, Joomla is still an active, uh, an active player of the CMS market. Um, I hope this answers the question. Uh, Joomla is a very, very vast topic to talk about. So it's just the tip of the iceberg. Uh, if you have any questions, Feel free to ask them in, in whatever way that is more convenient for you. Uh, until then, I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.